Hello Reese, welcome to Brutally True Jaro and this reading is about what's their next move in this reading I will try to see what your person is going to do next and uh, what they are thinking of so let's start and see Master Chess, excuse me Master Chess for Aries Ten of Wands. Eight of Pentacles. Seven of Swords, Four of Swords, the fool okay so seven of swords is here your person is trying to find a way out of the mess they have created or you can say that this person is trying to overcome their fear it could be about their insecurities it could be about their fears and uh, they are still trying to get over that. This could be a new person who is interested in you or probably this is someone you already know and you might have some kind of issues in your relationship and this person is uh, trying to figure out uh, how to make it perfect. Okay, here we have uh, four of swords in their brain. And then four of swords here looks like uh, at this point they want to relax maybe you feel that they are not doing anything they are numb they are unresponsive and uh, you feel that they are not interested but with this four of swords this person is already halfway there they are still working on something but at this point they are feeling tired they are feeling helpless and uh, they think that uh, they need to take some rest before they start this journey again and uh, that is what is they are doing right now so you might feel that this person is not uh, mm, interested but it's not the case okay we have this eight of pentacles also seems like uh, in this solitude yes this person wants to stay alone for a while looks like they're working on themselves and um, they are you know painting something it's about their dream they're spending a lot of time in their hobbies they are um, trying to calm their mind so that they can think clearly this person is feeling that um, they need to act as soon as possible. Here you see Ten of Wands. This person is carrying some kind of burden. This person is feeling that uh, they need to express themselves to you or they will be you know, misunderstood. You may not get what they actually mean or what they actually want with you. And uh, then they will be responsible for that. This person knows that uh, they need to get over this Ten of Wands. They need to get rid of these Ten of Wands. Now, in your case, this could be guilt, shame, or something else that is holding them back. And um, 
seems like one by one they are doing it. I mean, they're getting rid of these wants. They are um, on this path to victory. They know that they will have to get over these things if they want a stable relationship. After this Four of Swords, after this brick, the Fool card is showing that this person is going to do something dramatic. Something that you may not have expected. Because this person will not be afraid of taking a leap of faith. And uh, this person is uh, ready to take every risk. Nothing can stop them. This person is going to express themselves and uh, out of nowhere they might come to you and offer you something. Here you see this rose. They might offer you this lock and you will be like, uh, okay, where were you till now? And uh, why did you leave me alone in the first place? This person is uh, now ready to act. They know that they cannot keep waiting on you. Okay, I mean, they know that, uh, of course, it's not your responsibility to come to them and uh, you know sort of the issues this person knows that it's up to them a lot of sorts maybe you're dealing with an air sign this is a general reading it may not resonate with everyone the energy could be reversed as well also you can check your moon and rising sign let's go ahead and check some more messages for you King of Swords. Two of Pentacles. Princess of Pentacles and the Moon. So here we have King of Swords. Your person is experienced. They are better than before. They have learned a lot after this whole episode. With this Two of Pentacles, they feel like they cannot escape the attraction. Every time they choose to walk away or you choose to walk away, you both find each other once again and you are at the same point. This person has realized that uh, they need to get in the strength. Okay, they know that they cannot escape the reality. They cannot run away. And uh, they need to gather strength to deal with this situation. Also, you are princess of pentacles for them. That means uh, they find you perfect. Though a little bit practical. This person feels that you are guided by your mind rather than your heart. And uh, that makes them a bit insecure. They feel that they are in danger with the moon. This person feels that uh, you are not, uh, you know, slave of your emotions. And uh, that is why you can always act wisely. So seems like this person is uh, going to gather the strength. They are going to get over their fears and uh, they are going to approach you. Okay, they might call you or they might message you back. So let's check an oracle message for you. Wrong with wolves. 
Okay, so it's time to be yourself. You don't have to worry about anything Aries. Let your wild side be shown. Let this person know that uh, you are who you are and that's not going to change. They know that they are dealing with someone wild and uh, they will have to be very careful. So this was the reading for this week. I'm sorry. For what their next move is. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Till next video. Bye.